In this work, we present a novel contact line model to solve the interfacial physics between liquid, solid, and air. By coupling the contact line dynamics with solid and liquid, our method can simulate phenomena formed by the interplay of surface stresses, liquid pressure, and solid elasticity. When a liquid drop is deposited on a flexible thin plate, spontaneously wrapping of the droplet happens if the driving capillary forces overtake the elastic bending resistance of the solid. Here we show the wrapping of a drop with a square substrate, forming a flower-shaped structure. Here we show the same simulation with the contact curve rendered in red. The final conformation of capillary origami is dictated by the initial cut of the planar structure. We hereby show another three wrapping processes with different substrate shapes. In this example, we show the self-assembly of a dagger-shaped planar structure with soft bridge connections, forming a 3D cube at the final state. We hereby show the falling, splashing, and bouncing of water drops on cantilever beams and leaves with different hydrophobic and hydrophilic surface properties. Different collision and contact patterns between liquid and solid surfaces can be observed. By controlling the ratio of surface stresses at the liquid air and solid air interface, we are capable of controlling the contact angle on both rigid and deformable surfaces. We validate our contact line models with a series of 2D validations. A rigid ball originally trapped in a water drop can either escape or continue being trapped depending on its surface property. Liquid tends to attach to hydrophilic surfaces, which is known as adhesion. We show such effect by lowering and lifting a rigid hydrophilic ball. Self-wrapping in 2D can be controlled to form different contact angles, while previous coupling methods fail to consider the deformation driven by capillary forces. When dropping a heavy ball to a tank of water, floating and sinking behavior is completely determined by the hydrophobic or hydrophilic surface properties. Here we show some extra examples. Thanks for watching.